The digital voltage indicator product line offered by HD Electric Company, known as the DVI, are direct contact digital voltage indicators for use on overhead and underground distribution systems. An audible alarm beeps and the display indicates voltage whenever the voltage detected is 100 volts or higher. The DVI product line consists of four products. The DVI 100 for use up to 99 kV AC has a large two and a quarter inch display with a two digit readout. The DVI 100 comes in a red polymer housing. The DVI 100T for use up to 99 kV AC with an additional mode for use on underground elbows with capacitive test points. Like the DVI-100, the DVI-100T has a large two-quarter inch display with a two-digit readout and comes in a red polymer housing. The DVI-500 for use up to 500 kV AC has a large one and a half inch display with a three-digit readout. The DVI-500 comes in a black polymer housing. And the DVI-500T for use up to 500 kV AC with an additional mode for use on underground elbows with capacitive test points. Like the DVI 500, the DVI 500T has a large one and a half inch display with a three digit readout and comes in a black polymer housing. All four products share common features for their use and application. The features of the DVI are an on button which also serves as a self test. Just press and hold. An audible indication which sounds when voltage is present. A large auto ranging LED display. A rugged polymer housing. An instruction label on the back of the unit. A removable overhead probe with other optional probes available. A field replaceable 9 volt alkaline battery. And everything fits into a sleek carrying case with an optional carrying bag available. Here are some safety tips. Do not exceed the DVI maximum voltage rating. Do not touch the DVI during measurements. DVI housing should be considered to be at the same voltage as the conductor under test. Never allow another high voltage or grounded conductor to contact the instrument during use. Keep the DVI housing free and clear of all structures at all times. Bridging the DVI probe or housing from line to ground or line to line may cause a fault and arc. The DVI does not indicate voltages below 100 volts. Always use proper grounding procedures. A zero voltage reading on the DVI does not mean the line is dead or grounded. Grounded equipment or lines can appear to be live when in close proximity to energized conductors. Always test the DVI on a known voltage source before and after each use. The DVI is a voltage indicator, not a voltmeter. Do not attempt to make accurate voltage measurements for phasing or other applications with the DVI. The DVI is a direct contact device. The metal portion of the DVI probe must contact the metal conductor to be tested. Voltage indication on insulated conductors such as tree wire or spacer wire will be much lower than actual and may not indicate any voltage at all. The DVI indicates AC voltage only. It does not detect DC voltage such as charged capacitors or cable. Finally, make sure you read the important labels which are affixed to the product and that you read and understand the instruction booklet before proceeding. To operate the DVI, begin by pressing and holding the on button and verify that the display reads all eights and the beeper sounds. This tests the device as well as the battery for proper functioning. If you don't get this reading, replace the battery and retest. Another way to test for proper operation is to use the DVI proof tester. To do this, turn the DVI on by pressing and holding the on button and press and hold the tester's on button. Touch the DVI probe to the metal contact on the bottom of the tester. Before you use the DVI, select the proper probe for the application. The metal hook probe is for overhead only. Other probes are available for pad mount, live front, and dead front applications. To use the DVI on underground applications and on underground bushings, the optional IEP DVI probe is required. Simply install the DVI on the appropriate hot stick and test the DVI for proper operation by pressing and holding the on button, then directly contact the conductor. The DVI-T models differ from the standard DVI, 
because they offer the user the ability to check for voltage on underground elbows with capacitive test points. To use the DVI-T models in capacitive test point mode, the following steps are required. Before using, press and hold the on button which tests the DVI for proper operation. Install the correct probe for underground use and hand tighten. Test the DVI on a known voltage source such as an HD electric proof tester. Install the DVI on a hot stick. Press the on button again for test point mode and note the flashing decimal point. The DVI-T is now ready for use on capacitive test points. And now a few words about accuracy. The DVI indicates voltage based upon the electrical field strength surrounding the conductor. This can be greatly influenced by the geometry and the conductor and the presence of other nearby conductors. Be aware that expected accuracies when using the DVI can be from plus or minus 3% to plus or minus 25% depending on how it's being used. Please refer to the instruction manual for further details. For best overall accuracy, the following guidelines may be helpful. The best overall accuracy is with a single energized conductor mid-span with no nearby grounds. Expected accuracy is plus or minus 3%. In a typical overhead three-phase system with horizontal spacing, the best accuracy is on the two outside conductors. Expected measurement accuracy on the two outside conductors is plus or minus 5%. On the center conductor, expected accuracy is plus or minus 10%. In more complex situations with transmission or other high voltage overbuild, accessory hardware such as fuses or disconnects or for measurements made on points such as terminations or endpoints. The best accuracy is with the DVI as far away as possible from other live conductors or grounds and away from points or corners and facing the ground. Expected overall accuracy is plus or minus 25 percent. For measurements made on grounded conductors, keep the DVI as far away as possible from energized conductors and face the DVI towards the ground. Readings on grounded conductors with nearby energized conductors may indicate 0.1 to 0.2 kV or more. For the best accuracy, with readings on pad mount equipment, live front or dead front, keep the DVI housing clear of adjacent grounds. Expected overall accuracy is plus or minus 10%. When the testing is complete, simply remove the DVI from the hot stick and store it in its protective carrying case. The DVI shuts off automatically after use, so there's nothing else you need to do. And now here's some important safety information. First. This product is designed for use by professionals trained in its use and application in and around high voltage electrical equipment. Second, if you're not trained in the work methods required for safe operations, don't proceed until you obtain the proper training. Third, work safe. Follow all applicable federal, state, company, and OSHA work practices at all times. And fourth, instructions and labels are included and attached to all products. Make sure you read and understand these before using the product. Instructions are also available 24-7 on the company website, hdelectriccompany.com. Thank you for your interest in HD Electric Company and its products.